Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be making a Michigan clock here and then we're going to be putting an M on it that is uh, hydrated blue and yellow and then the, this Michigan black will be stained. So uh, we'll hope this turns out good. If you haven't seen any of my other videos yet, uh, please go see those and leave a like and Subscribe to my channel and comment down below too. So please enjoy this video. So now we're going to start cutting out this M here, and uh, I'm going to be, like I said earlier, I'm going to be hydrating it uh, blue and yellow after I cut it out. So we'll see how this goes. Alright guys, so what we're going to do first before we hydro dip it is we're going to give it a base coat of this blue and that way if it all the hydro dip paint doesn't cover all of it, it won't have that wood color. It'll still all have the main colors on it, which is going to be blue and yellow. So I'm going to be giving it its base coat right now. Okay, this is a little embarrassing. Um, I forgot to turn the camera down while I painted that. But it's painted, so yeah, the base coat's on now. So there's just one positive thing, but try to turn the camera on a hydro dip and stuff. <laughs> Here, I'll show you guys a better view, hopefully. So, can't really get a good view, but that's what it's looking like. So now I'm just going to be mixing this around and uh, with this, and then I'll put in the
There we have it. The blue and yellow Michigan. I think it turned out pretty good. Hands got a little bit. I didn't put a glove on that one for some reason. Oh well. Anyway. Um, I just have a little nail here. So it's hung in like that. I just drilled a little hole on the back of it and stuck the nail in it. That way it can drag it. And, um, but that's how it's looking. Sometimes it's kind of weird with the hydro dipping because it looks like there's a ton of blue on it like it was for this one is what it looked like but it turns out with a good amount of yellow on it so if you're just getting into it and there's not much of a color that you're thinking it's probably underneath that layer but I think it turned out pretty good so yeah we'll nail this on and then the plaque will be done And put a nail in dead center here in the back, one here and one there. So I don't know if you can see that, but right here, there, and there. Let's put one in. So, uh, yeah, that's what I did. But it's finished now. So all I gotta do is put some uh, this lacquer on it. It's kind of like a clear coat. It just gives it a good. Um, cover up coat so that it doesn't uh, rot or anything like that and it'll last a long time but uh, thank you for watching this video please leave a like and subscribe and leave a comment down below and hit the bell for more of my all of my new videos um, please watch my other videos if you haven't yet and um, check those out I got a few other I think I have like 10 others right now so I got lures and a whole bunch of other stuff you can check out how to make so, uh, hope you enjoyed this video.